Hi everyone, my name is Kate Christie and I'm a time management expert. And I was sitting exactly where you are 18 months ago. I entered the KPI program with an established online business of four years, a national business called Babysitters and More. And BAM's essentially an outsourcing portal where we connect very busy people with local home helpers such as nannies, cleaners, housekeepers, elder carers, and so on. Um, but to be honest, KPI changed all of that. Um, for example, I didn't have a niche. Um, I thought that I was in the business of helping anyone and everyone who was looking to outsource domestic help. Wrong. I was actually in the business of working with very clever, successful female professionals and entrepreneurs aged between 30 and 55 who were looking for new strategies to better manage the work-life juggle. And I now have a reputation for helping those clients find and harness 30 hours of lost time a month. Another key for me in my business journey with KPI was the whole, whole process of unpacking my IP and productizing every element of my business. Um, so I, I had the BAM product and, and I'd come into KPI thinking this is what I'm going to grow. But what I soon learned was that I had taken for granted what I thought was common sense was actually my intellectual property. And by undertaking the process of unpacking that intellectual property, not only was I able to offer greater value and more products to my clients, but I was able to create additional income streams for me. So now, alongside BAM, under a overarching uh, brand called Time Stylers. Um, it, we have the BAM portal, I have my book, I have um, an online coaching program, I have one-on-one -on -one coaching, I have corporate workshops and I have speaking engagements. Which is mind-blowing considering where I was 18 months ago. In addition to that, I've actually been able to monetize my expertise in the online space and social media um, because I now have the five Ps, I know how to do that, and I now advise other small businesses on how to create successful social media campaigns for their business. In November of last year, I wrote or I published my first book, Me Time, The Professional Woman's Guide to Finding 30 Guilt-Free Hours a Month. And that helped me realise a lifetime dream, really, of becoming a published author. Since then, I've spent a lot of my time trying to build my credibility and my profile as a time management expert for women. And I've managed to secure some fantastic opportunities, including appearing on uh, New Zealand Breakfast Television, being asked to provide commentary in the media, writing for websites like Women's Agenda, The Huff Post. I have, um, was recognised in the Ant Hill 2015 Top 100 Services. I've been invited by the Osmumpreneur Network to be a judge in their upcoming Osmumpreneur Awards. And I've also secured um, paid paid um, gigs with corporates, both in a workshop and a speaking um, sense across the retail, finance, banking, legal um, and recruitment industries. Um, in the last two weeks, I've been paid to appear before my niche market in Melbourne, Sydney, Brisbane, Adelaide, Darwin and Perth. And that put me in front of 200 new hot leads within my niche, all looking for smarter time management. Um, and in the next two weeks, I have four more speaking engagements. In the last um, seven months, so since January of this year, I've bought out my business partner, so I now own the business um, myself, and I've seen business growth implementing the KPI principles of 300% this year. And I'm on track to continue that trajectory into 2016. So that's my story. My name's Kate Christie. I'm the time styler, and I'm having the time of my life. Thank you.